Another thing that can happen in English are multi-meaning words. Word, there are many words in English that have many meanings, and they can be very, very different. And so when you're reading something in a piece of training materials, we need to choose a word that probably doesn't have a bunch of different meanings. Try to choose a word that has one meaning. Yeah, so advise. Anybody use advise in their workplace when they email? Okay, advise has a bunch of meanings. What can, what can you be asking for when you use the word advise? Direction? What? Feedback. Feedback? Those are very different. What else? Please advise. What are you asking for? Help. Response. Response. Please respond. Those are really different. And so if you want something, you need to be specific in your language when you ask for it. If you need a signature, ask for them to sign it. If you need a response, ask for them to respond. If you need a direction, say, please provide direction. That's different than just please advise and just throw it over the wall and hope they figure out what we need. So 